Gambit and Deadpool. How does this look? Not bad. I like the look of that though. Okay, so let's do this. Let's put these comics away for now. And take these guys out. And I'm going to take off the backing boards on these before I put them in. If you do feel like uh, knowing what the first appearances are like uh, for these characters, there's a video of, uh, uh, of me reading uh, Sam Keith's Max Primer number five, and there's one of uh, reading Grendel uh, Comic Book Primer number two, first appearances of both characters. Uh, they're pretty cool. So let's take this, flip it around, let's see what we can do. So we're gonna do the same thing, we'll bring them those uh, this plier and pull these guys out. Alright. I'm gonna do this with my hands and see how far I get. There's little uh, pins here that I gotta pull up so I can remove uh, the mat. Pulling it out is not as big of a deal as putting it back in. It's putting it back in took some effort. it and little bits of stuff would get in there which is a pain and you gotta open it up again you know little bits of cardboard or whatever it'd be nice if I had a glass table so as soon as I laid it down I could take a look to see if there's any little dust particles or little bits of paper stuck in the frame And I put tape behind these to hold them together, hold them up. Blow on it. Now, what we're going to do is put this here and take these off. Now, taking them off is a little trickier because I got tape behind these and there we go and this is tales of suspense um, Iron Man Captain America I just felt like looking at that thing I thought it was pretty so I framed it And this one is Hawkman number four, or sorry, uh, Brave and the Bold at number 42. It's a Hawkman appearance. There we go. 
<laughs> there's another picture behind this that came with the frame. So obviously this is not a professional job on my part, right? I'm just doing it enough. So you can tell there's another picture there and that was taking up this whole frame. I was like, what? That's crazy. So we need to center this guy. First thing I'm gonna do is uh, take the backing boards away from these. Right, should have shown you that, but so just take the backing board away and I'm gonna center this. And this is the way I center it with Mylar. I just use my fingers, I tap, and the comics usually slip around. And, and this one definitely the board has to come out. centered pretty good, pretty good now the question is hmm. now these are uh, golden age mylars I just wanted things to be able to breathe so what I'll, all I'm going to do is just line them up and drop them down should be centered so kick this up a bit I should measure this theoretically but uh, I think this will work and I'm not gonna push it down unless I'm 100% happy with it Tape measure and measure this. One and a quarter about. And this is too much on this side. So oops, we're gonna have to bring this guy over. And bring this guy. tape so it can roll like this so what I do I line it up this way more and get it approximate like this a quarter that's about three that's okay because that's got a top on it so that looks good let's check this out one more time one a quarter and a bit Looks good. One and a quarter. One and a quarter. So let's check this out. The primer number five is a little bit bigger than primer number two, which is uh, sort of sucks. Okay. That's 
that's what we got. So now what we need to do is put this guy back in the glass. So what I'm going to do for sure is blow on here just to uh, see just a little bit of cardboard that might be on the glass that I didn't see. back in without doing too much movements on it. Bend these down at the four centers and then take a look at that. The framed comics to see if it's centered. Okay, let's take a look. Can you see? Does that look nice? Side. Looks nice, no? Primer number two, primer number five. Let me take a look. That looks great. Two of the main characters that came out uh, in the 1980s and 1990s, or 1980s anyway, and they had their full-blown, they went ballistic in the 1990s, both these characters. Matt Wagner with Grendel and Sam Keith with uh, the Max, or Max. So, so far in the framed comics, and I have more frames, I just don't have enough wall. Or actually, I do have some wall, but I think the next one is going to be it for now, and then we'll do another rotation later on. Because I do rotate the comics that are in the frames. Um, I'm pretty sure the glass that these frames are in is UV protected, um, but I'm not 100% sure. So um, I rotate these and I got to take these frames in just to get the glass checked out to make sure it's uh, UV protected. But uh, I do just rotate them because I like to see different things, right? And um, I do have a okay collection. Uh, you know, if I could afford it, I could buy it. Just keep that there. pretty and it should go well with the wall 